$6.6 million increase uh, for the funding of schools. We will direct uh, divisions to uh, keep their tax increase to 2% uh, at the same time that uh, you know, we have a mandate for public service uh, to, uh, to have two years of no increases. So we're controlling about 80% of the costs, which are salaries for school divisions, uh, and giving them a half a percent increase while they're able to increase their own taxation by 2%. Uh, I think in this environment of uh, running more than a half a billion dollar deficit still, uh, which is a significant challenge for the province, I think that is, uh, that is a reasonable place for them to be. Uh, last year, uh, they essentially had the same thing. Uh, there was an increase of uh, 232 uh, positions across uh, across the school divisions. They hired 232 new positions, so not replacing existing positions, but new positions. So clearly, there is still uh, flexibility and ability to fulfill the needs. The uh, ratio of students per uh, teachers remains the same. That hasn't changed according to the department. So I think it's a reasonable place to be, uh, given where we are in the economic environment.